Alright, so, I just want to make a quick video on the Murray. Um, I haven't really showed it that much on YouTube. I've talked about it. But, you know, I did that one riding video. That's about it. But, um, I'll show, like, everything on this. So, currently, it's running no battery, disabled C safety, um, has a five-speed Spicer, Spicer 4360-85, I think, I think it's a 96. Somebody had put these Craftsman, these, like, 20 by 10 by 8 Craftsman tires on it. They're huge. And it has a stance like this. But, um, it has, like, a, like a Poland front wheel and tire. And just another, like, Craftsman front, front wheel, I think. So, I don't know what happened to it. It's a, it came with this cover on it. I don't know how they managed to rig it up, but... I bought the correct-ish cover for it. It's for Craftsman 2, but same motor. Um, it was the cheapest one I could find. It's 20 bucks on eBay. But um, this is just a deck pulley mounted on the three little studs on here, like Fearless Front did. That's literally it, not even a notch. I just, I just pull it tight while I'm wrapping it, and it works just fine. No slip. Fires it right up. And, um, currently, yeah, I know. I know. It's not good. I'm, I'm gonna get just at least some threaded pipe to do something with that. But, I keep meaning to put the foam back on here. But, since it has the wrong intake and stuff, or I have to pull, sorry, I don't like, Putting it at max throttle, so I just have this hooked up. It's a little bit of wire. I just stick it in that hole, and it chokes it for me. Then when it fires up, just kind of go like that. But it works perfectly. It's pulley swapped with a four-inch pulley. I can show you under here a little. See, there's a. F it's got a ten-dollar Amazon belt. Works perfect. Four-inch back there. Regular stock pulley up there. Don't mind how oily it is. Just don't mind it. Um. Yeah. Um. I got this hooked up the other day. Hit 20, 20 miles an hour on it, surprisingly. Just, it just routes around here from the governor. Around here. Over to here. Right there. Put this around your shoe. Rev it. <laughs> Rev it to the moon, but works perfectly. Yeah, it's very small, actually. It's smaller than my Craftsman's, like that one and that one. We're mid-wheel change right here. Let's see, we're in the tires. I'm getting some starting fluid later to blow those on, but... Five speed works perfect. Runs good. I think it needs a carpet clean, but runs good. Um, I was about to say cuts good. This thing does not cut grass. <laughs> but the other thing I had to do with this um, cover, I had to drill a hole and stick a bolt with a bunch of washers and crap there to clear the flywheel. This is just a random tiny little bolt I had. Because I don't have, like, anything. But that's about it. 12 horsepower IC, I think. It it runs good. Um, I do, actually, this mower has um, 18 by 10 by 8s. I want to get... This one holds air. It's held air ever since I got it a year ago. Like, it literally hasn't lost any air. And this one, it loses air within five seconds. It needs to be, if I, I might tube it and then 
swap those tires onto here so it sits level and then just have the big tires on this one so yeah that's what i'm thinking about doing maybe sometime i'll get some front wheels i might end eventually end up getting some of the like tra the smaller 18 by 10 by 8 tractor tires or ag tires or super lug whatever you want to call them v-tread <laughs> whatever you want to call them but it's still got good torque. Like, sometimes I pull people around in that lawn cart over there. And, um, this is the perfect mower to do it with. Yeah. That's about it. I've stretched this out long enough. There's nothing really else to talk about. But it, it, it did 20 miles an hour with that yesterday. Usually it does about 11 so, that was pretty good. But, here you go. There's the Murray for you. It's a solid mower. Very solid, actually. These Murrays are built tough, man. You, like, if you don't have a Murray... Why did I say it like that? Murray? If you don't have a Murray, um... You should probably get one because they're really nice. That's about it. <laughs> they're really nice. I really, I'd recommend you get you like a Murray wide body, like one of the opposed twin Murray wide bodies. My cousin has one. It's amazing. It has like belt issues because it has a two and a half inch pulley on the back, but that's literally it. It's amazing. He's had no issues with the motor. Everything else he's had issues with on it, but just just not the motor. Why am I saying this? I don't know why I'm saying it. Just get you a Murray Widebody. They're amazing, okay? I'm saying, like, oh, yeah, it's all messed up. It's all messed up besides the motor. No, it's it's fine. It's really nice, though. Um, Murray. That's a Murray. 12 horsepower, 38 inch cut. I don't know why I keep... I'm just going to end the video. Have a good day. Bye.